So guys, so we've got quite an interesting review coming up today. Um, it's actually a quite a hyped pre-workout that you're going to find out about shortly. A lot of people have, uh, oh my god. Oh Jesus! Ah! <laughs> All right, it's Review Bros back with an old school classic style of filming because it's been called for. And as a one year anniversary tribute, we are going to throw back to our old reviews in the car. In the classic. Yeah, yeah without too much, uh, what's the word? Waffling. Really. Yeah, we're not going to go into extreme detail like we normally mm. do. As guys, just so you know, this is like Craig said, a one off style tribute classic. Mm. And a lot of our followers have called for this, called for a shorter video, called for some training footage called for a bit more of a casual review so we're bringing it to you today to get your thoughts basically on it yeah. um so what are we so, doing at today we are looking at leather phase an american pre-workout a dmaa classic um big thank you to god of thunder for sending us this you know that guy's a legend he knows his pre yeah. so he knows this is one of his top favorites mm. so that means it's gonna be good so let's get into it okay guys as you see we're gonna put in the clip now of us drinking the pre-workout quick taste segment very quickly Comes out green, we're not sure on the flavour because God of Thunder sent it. Big shout out to God of Thunder. Massive thank you, what a legend. Let's give it a go. We think it's going to be apple. <laughs> Cheers. Mm. And it is apple. A very sour apple. Oh. You don't like that, do you? <laughs> Damn. It's like toxic waste apple. Mm. For me, I like apple, so that's probably like a free I prefer it sour five. like that than a weak apple. Bit. Really? Hmm, I like that. What would you go out of five? Easier four. Really? Yeah. Shit, I've matched that. I'm happy with that. Yeah, <laughs> four. And it obviously comes in that apple flavour we just had, and it comes in strawberry slaughter melon, so watermelon strawberry, my guess. Um, we gave the taste a good score, you know? Yeah. Good four out of five. Went down easy. Mixability was a bit shit, but hey-o. Yeah. You know, who gives a f <laughs> when it comes to the DMAAs? Exactly, whatever it takes for the highness. Whatever it takes, baby. <laughs> So that's taste really, two flavours that we're aware of, went down okay, on to the next one. Okay guys, moving into the price of the product, we're not going into detail, detail as we normally do dot com. Um, Rusco Supplements sell this and they're worldwide so you want to get hold of it, go to them. Um, not sure about Aggressive Labs Direct, you know, worth dropping them a DM on the, um, on the old Instagram. Pfft, ranges really, um, customs charges, you know, um, shipping charges. That's the killer. About 30, 35 quid, 37 dollars, you know, you might find it cheaper, do have a look around. Um, you know, it's going to be between a quid, quid 25 ago, so it's not a bad price by the looks of things. Yeah, not for what you get. Exactly that, so uh, do have a look around, eBay do it, you know, Amazon probably might, mm, no, actually tell a lie, Amazon won't because no. of the banned ingredient in it. You know, Rusco supplements, as I say, they do do worldwide shipping on mm. this and a lot of other decent goody goodies. So, um, check them out. Have a look, guys. Not a bad price. Powerful label time, right, Aaron? Yeah, this is a good one, actually. A lot better than I expected. You know, I Buzzing. didn't really look into it, but hey, go for it. All right, I'm just going to bang through it and then Aaron's going to sum it up. So, citrulline malate, eight grams. Beta alanine, four grams. Creatine monohydrate, three grams. Agmatine sulfate, <laughs> one gram. I'm still buzzing off this pre workout. Caffeine anhydrous, 500 milligrams. N acetyl L tyrosine, 500 milligrams. Sinophrine HCL, 80 milligrams. One to three DMF, 45 milligrams DMAA. Black pepper extract, 10 milligrams, higher than normal. Your Himbine HCL, 3 mg. Boom. Boom, massive, massive dose of L uh, citrulline malate, eight grams. You know, you don't often see that, actually. No. Shocked out of my mind, because normally these DMAA styles, they don't, you know, they- They fuck off the pump element. Yeah, they just stim you up to high heaven and then give a fuck about the rest. Mm. Um, so yeah, beat running in again, four grams, was it? Yeah. That's a good itchy, itchy time. Yeah, we love um, that. Bit of endurance there. Mm. Uh, Cifranine, as you know, another fat burning, but also gives you that highness, that buzz. Yeah. 45 mg, uh, one free to meth. Not the highest, but blimey, if That's it's all the in there, then it will be doing that trick or two. Um, you know, so again, not going into the label as heavy as we normally would, but I can tell you now, it's very stim heavy. It's, it's dosed well, it's stacked well, it's got pump focus. And Even creatine, three grams, yeah. you know, considering it, considering what it is, that's virtually coming on what you'd stand Daily alone. Taker, yeah. So, um, yeah. And you don't actually see beta, beta alanine dose that highly in DMAA pre's either. Normally you don't see it at all, don't do you? Don't see it at all, no. So, um, you know, love the label. Yeah. How's it come together, we'll let you know. 
So how did we feel this fucking hyped up leather face pre-workout? Boom. Well, we'll drop some training footage now to show the effects. So as you can see, pumps were sick to, uh, to yeah, start. Yeah, really painful pumps, considering exactly what it is. You wouldn't expect them. No. Beta tingles through the roof, Scra it. itchy, scratchy. Um, <laughs> you know, really, really was good. Mm. Um, pff, energy was super high, focused as you know AF. In My the muscle gym. connection. We blasted through chest. We even did some um, sort of different stuff like uh, under te time under tension, men's pause style. Reps, you know, have a look sorts. at that. Have a look. Um, yeah, powerful, powerful pre. Um, I still feel energised. However, the only weakness to this pre is after two hours of solid training, you do have a and not as bad as I thought. No. A small come down. Considering there's no anti-crash ingredients, you will yeah. notice that they've just slammed caffeine and slammed DMAA in it, not giving a fuck about the come down. So that considering, you don't really come down too bad, but like Aaron said, you do notice the slight tapering after a couple hours. What I will say is very, very, very good. Stim junkie heavy. Give yeah. it a go, guys. That's all mm. I can say. It is one of our favourites. Yeah, instantly. Um, for Because of the little bit of crash, tiny, 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 I'd give it a solid, I'd give it a 4.75 out of I 5. I literally would, yeah. Only bringing it down on that, because pumps were to be saluted. Beta Energy only. was brilliant. Beta alanine tingles, we love, that was brilliant. Another important factor to note that I don't think we mentioned in our review is that it does give you a very nice, happy social high, like a euphoric high where you want to talk to people, you're quite chatty, happy, um, just a good feeling one, which I don't think we mentioned, so also worth noting. Don't really have too much to pick at, do we? That 0.25 is just that very, very small crash, so, mm. you know, that's a 9.5 out of 10 for you. Uh, people who don't know what 4.75 out is. Yeah, but out of five. you know, aggressive labs, you smashed it with this. Mm. Smashed it. Really and we're good. excited to see what other products you do that we can hopefully get hold of from you direct and um, we can get into them. Cheers for watching, guys. And as always, stay stimmed. Boom, and you will.